Hi there. I found for today an article that says that Kathleen Kennedy will not be seeing renewal or extension of her contract when it expires in 2024. The rumor comes from a well-known scooper, WDW Pro, which at most of the times he has trustworthy sources. But as we heard, there's some bargaining happening. Because even if she leaves, she still wants some EPs, executive producer credits on two theatrical releases, and creative consultation rights. And she even wants to be on set for two theatrical releases. It's a common practice for former directors or producers to get executive producer credits even if they weren't active at the last production. It's more like a tribute to their former work there. But for the rest, she's just asking for too much, and probably Disney won't back down on those demands. She practically wants these things to keep her name on the brand. The other rumor is that John Favreau was offered the position of creative director, but he won't be alone in this position. There will be a duality, like it is in DC with Peter Safran and James Gunn. I think this is much more better because one can keep the other in check. It's great news to see John Favreau at the helm of Lucasfilm, but we won't get a full Lucasfilm team straight away. We are probably going to get a transitioning period. This means that we're going to be stuck with Kathleen Kennedy for a bit longer, even after the expiration date of her contract. But this extension won't be announced to public, they will keep it under wraps. As for the position of creative director that Jon Favreau was offered, it's been held by Dave Filoni at the moment. There's also another rumor that's been looming around that he hasn't accepted the position yet, which lines with my previous video that nobody wants the position of the head of Lucasville, though they have been a lot of rumors of Kathleen Kennedy getting fired, all of them have been proven to be just rumors. But with this last flop, but with Indiana Jones and the Dial of Destiny bombing at the box office, which is now around 300 million in the red, adds some validity to these rumors. The rest of the article talks about the past failures of Lucasfilm, which adds up with the current rumors. Let's see if this time Kathleen Kennedy leaves Lucasfilm so we can get some people that can give some fresh ideas to make Star Wars great again. If you like the video, give a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and if you want to comment, use the comment section below. Thank you and have a good one.